Hi everyone, thank you so much for clicking on today's video. My name is Brittany if you're new here and if you're not new, welcome back. So happy to have you back for another video. So today we have a very unexpected video. I did not plan on buying a laptop, but my trusty 2013 MacBook Air finally gave out. Um, we had a long run. Honestly, I had this all throughout high school and throughout most of college, I'm entering my senior year, but also I didn't graduate in four years so you know it's been a long time with this computer and yeah I think it's an issue with the display um, there's just like lines over it. I tried a lot of different things it actually died today in the morning when I woke up I was trying to do a back and bicep workout and I always like to find a Caroline Gervin one and the screen did not come on I tried a bunch of different things and none of them worked and so basically I looked up like how much it may cost to fix it because I'm pretty sure it's just an issue with the screen like if I do certain things I can hear sounds so like it's not completely dead but yeah it said that that could cost like $200 and I might have to wait like weeks because it is so old and they might not have the same screen in it might not be so easy to replace and I start school in like less than two weeks so I need a laptop um so I figured the best solution was to buy a new one and also like this one has battery problems the backlight for the keyboard hasn't worked in years um I don't know just a lot of issues so I felt like it was finally time to upgrade and yeah so I'm entering my senior year of my undergrad and then I'll be doing an internship program and master's program that's probably going to be all online so you know, I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this computer, and here she is. It's heavy. MacBook Air. This is a 13 inch MacBook Air with Apple M1 chip, 8 gigabyte unified memory, and then uh, 256 gigabyte SSD, whatever that means. And yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and begin the unboxing. I want to set it up. Um, I always like doing kind of, I don't know if it's aesthetic is the right word, but like I like having my setup a certain way. Like if you guys watched my iPhone uh, 13 Pro setup, like I, I liked how I did that. And so I kind of want to do similar type of video and yeah, just basically get it ready for when I do my like back to school video I'm gonna do like more in depth uh, like screen things but let's get her open all right hopefully this angle is okay it's nighttime when I'm filming this so might not be the best but hopefully it's okay so here is my beautiful MacBook has the plastic on and everything I don't know oh yeah here's the area to open random fun fact I've never bought a MacBook brand new I've always bought them used and well actually I've only had two in my whole life but um always used this is my first new one but I figured buying a new one might be better so then I don't have to worry about anything that might happen Ooh. Okay, oh my gosh. <laughs> As you can tell, I don't do many unboxings, but. Wow, so clean. First look. Oh my gosh. Wow, it looks so clean. Okay, before we get into this, um, I just wanna see like what else is in the box. Wow, it's so clean. And I don't even have a case yet, so I'm kind of nervous. But yeah, of course we have our charger. This looks very different than the one that I used for my last laptop but also it was 2013 so makes sense um then we have some you know everything that comes 
And then, ow, can't get out. <laughs> there we go. Charging cube. So now I'm just starting the setup process. All right, so we're all set up, did all the boring stuff that you guys probably don't really care much about. I showed you a little bit. Um, but anyway, here is like the processing system if you care. So the exact laptop is the MacBook Air M1 2020. I did buy this in 2022, but this was the older version because I didn't want to pay the extra like $300 for the new one. Um, yeah, like I said, that's all of that stuff. And now I just want to do like a few customizations to kind of make it like my own laptop because no offense, but I really don't like this background. Just not my thing. And like it just kind of boring looking. So I want to do like put a cool little 2022 calendar wallpaper. I'll show you guys what I mean. Um, but I like having it. I had one on my old computer. Um, I want to find like a cute clock screensaver. Also had it on my old computer. I want to make some folder icons. Okay, so right now I'm just going to try to find um, a wallpaper. I actually have this website that I really like using. Um, you also can make your own if you want. Not really my thing. Um, you can use Canva. I've done it before. I just I think it's easier just to find one that's already ready to go. So I actually like these from ohsolovelyblog.com. They have like free monthly wallpapers. And then they have like the little printable calendars. Um, yeah, and basically, they have all of these. I really like the mountain ones. Let's see what they have. This one's kind of cool. Um, so I did order a case already, which is going to come tomorrow. I'll show you guys, like, when it comes tomorrow. But it's basically, like, the same case that I had for my old computer, which is just, like, this, like, kind of green one. So I'm thinking, like, mountains or something similar would go well with it. Um, and I just like having the little, like, calendars, just, I don't know, I feel like it's helpful even, though, even if I'm not really using them. Hmm, okay, I think, I did see, like, a mountain one. This one's really nice. I think this might have been the one that I used before, I don't remember. Um, but yeah, let's just click on this. And I like Sunday Start. So, I like it a lot. So, yeah, we're going to do this one. I'm pretty, yeah, this is actually the same one that I had. But, you know, it's fine. Okay. So, here it is. So I just put it on my desktop. And then, um, you want to add the little plus, And then desktop. Here it is. Choose. And then, there we go. That is currently my background i think it's nice it has a little calendar of 2022 in the corner crazy how we're already in august oh my gosh i don't even want to talk about it um but okay that's one thing done and then the next thing i want to do is try to find the clock screensaver that i liked to use um i just it's the one that's like the big it's like the aesthetic one you see on tiktok i don't know you guys probably know but um big clock It's this one. F L I Q L O. You guys, you guys already know. We're going to go ahead and download it. Here it is. And then you just kind of go along with the process. Here it is. That was so fast. Okay, that was way faster. Show screensaver after 20 minutes. I think that's good. I want to set it up to where I can put, um, like, hot corners where I can, like, do that. Um, go in the left corner and then it will go to my screensaver. 
So we're gonna do start screensaver. Um I think that's good. Honestly, I don't think I really would use the other the other hot corner. Oh, in the corner, left corner, screensaver. So nice. I know. I love it. <laughs> and it's it's so late, but I'm filming. Um, and then, yeah, that's, that's that. And then the next thing I wanted to do, I guess the last thing for customization is really just folder icons. Um, I am starting school soon, so I don't know exactly like what classes are going to be what but I know I want to make three of them so now I'm just trying to find folder icons um I first was just trying to see if I could find like a bundle of them didn't really find much so we're just gonna do it um we're gonna do let's like do a watermelon one fruit uh icon and then let's see what comes up I want something cute, maybe like this one's kind of cute, right? Or this one? <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. So then you just go to the page it's from. You're gonna do Control, click on it, and then just do Copy. Oh, oops, sorry. You're gonna click on it, Control, Copy, Image, like that, and then you're gonna go back to your home screen you're going to click file new folder it's going to pop up right there you're going to just go ahead and click on it open it up get info and all you need to do is command v which paste it on there and then that's your folder you can also name it there personally i'm just not going to name it because um I need to do this like in my back to school video so I just want to make the folders and then we'll figure the rest out later. So then maybe we'll do, I guess I can just search on this website, it doesn't really matter. Um, fruit? <laughs> I don't know what's going to come up. Oh cute! Okay these are cute, these are so cute, oh my gosh. I love this. Now I'm rethinking everything now, but <laughs> I love this one. I'm going to do this one. So you just, once again, copy image. You're going to go ahead and come to your home page, new folder. You're going to click control and click it and then get info. Click on this little blue thing and then command V. There you go. That's simple. Okay, cute. Let's find another one. Maybe I should find the ones that go together. Yeah, maybe I should just get this whole bundle. Alright, we're changing plans. We're getting this whole bundle. <laughs> I want the kiwi. So we're just gonna copy image. I'm changing the watermelon to the kiwi. There we go. So I just made these five. I think they're really, really cute. They don't have names yet because like I said, I have to wait until I start my classes or like figure out more. But I made five just because they're so cute and they go together well. And here we are. So I think we're all set up pretty much. I'm waiting for my case to come and I'll show you guys once it comes tomorrow. But yeah, I'm so happy with everything. My case just came in the mail. It's like the next day. Um, and this is the M-O-S-I-S-O -S -S -O plastic hard shell case. Um, and yeah, this is like in a forest green color. So I'm just going to go ahead and open this and use my computer.
All right, that concludes my MacBook Air unboxing, setup, and customizations. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up down below if you did enjoy it. Um, yeah, I won't be doing videos like this hopefully anytime soon, but I still hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. Um, yeah, but I will be doing some like back to school videos where I will be showing my MacBook and doing all of like digital, more customization, stuff like that. So if you guys enjoy that, um, more will be coming. But anyway, please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in my next video very, very soon.